Hey everybody, it's Chris coming to you from PipesTraveler.com with another episode of Stupid Stuff. Hey, we're down in Horseshoe Bend Park near Rogers, Arkansas. Beautiful early fall day here in early October. Weather is just fantastic. But I want to tell you a little bit about the Stupid Stuff episode we've got for you today. It's all about your fishing tackle and your fishing gear and having it safeguarded for when you're traveling. Now, whether you're an RVer like we are, if you have a pickup truck or some other kind of vehicle, an SUV, it's a really good idea to organize all your fishing gear to make it safe so that you can store it and carry it and have access to it pretty quickly, pretty easily. So that's what this episode's all about today. So let me get into it with you a little bit right now. As you can see here in the back of our pickup truck, I've got my toolbox down here and I'll tell you about that during another episode. But up on the top is our little fishing box. So let me show you that, show that to you right now. really not heavy at all. It's easy to get out if you need to, to set it down by your pickup truck. But you can see the design is fairly simple. It's about, it's about 13 inches wide, about a half a foot deep, so about six inches deep, and four and a half feet long. I've got it marked here so that I can line up my, uh, my markings here in case you kind of set your, side, your, your lid aside. But you can see here that it's all pegged all the way around. I've got six pegs in the top of the box, making it really easy. You don't have to have a hinge or anything. The lid stays on very securely. So if you want to access it, you just simply lift it off, tilt it back, and you have access to all your gear inside your fishing box here. Uh, we have This has worked really great for us. We've been fishing all over the country. Uh, it's large enough where it holds easily three fly rods. I've got two spin tackle outfits. I've got an ultralight uh, for some of the small lakes and, and rivers that are freshwater. And then I've got a more heavyweight uh, outfit in here so for some of the coastal areas. You've got a couple of hats in here in case you forget a hat. you got some basic fishing tackle in here. Uh, this is just a little fishing bag that I threw in here in case I want to just grab something real quick and throw a few lures in there. So that's kind of what that's all about. And then over here you got some of your other smaller supplies and things like that. And oh, my goodness. In case you get snake bit, you got to have a little whiskey in there just to kind of calm your nerves a little bit. A couple of bottles of fresh water and some rain gear. This little fishing tackle box has just been awesome. Uh, we're really happy about it. It's been working out really great for us. Um, you can build this, obviously, custom build it to any size, any design that you want. But just wanted to show this to you, give you an idea of a, of a great tool that we've used. Works great for us. And uh, so that's it. That's all we've got today from PipesTraveler.com. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Stupid Stuff. If you do, give us a thumbs up and please subscribe to our channel. Thanks very much and so long from Arkansas. Thanks.